All right, so this is going to be your Vimeo uh, tutorial. So we're going to go ahead and start on the Vimeo web page. Click login. And it's your email and password. All right, so now we are in Vimeo. So pretty basic. Um, you're going to go ahead and to add a new video, just click new video and upload. You can either choose a file or you can just click this upper right hand and you can drag a file in. All right. So that is going to be for your password protected videos. So this is just regular like YouTube, you drop in a file and anyone can see them, um, but you have access to those privacy settings. And so you can go ahead and drag in your video here and then um, access your privacy settings to put it as password protected. Um, to do a video on demand, um, you're going to click manage videos or hover over and then sell videos. All right. So right now we have two tests. You can go ahead and delete this um, when you're ready and we can delete those off of your page. But I'm going to show you the steps to go through and click create a uh, video on demand. So you're going to go ahead and create a new video. So first you're going to want to choose if you want to um, create a single video or film or a series of videos. So for now we're going to just do single video. You're going to title test four, test four. Release year 2020, genre, let's just say documentary. You can add tags if you want, all audiences, and English. Save and continue. Save and continue. You want people to buy. You're gonna you're gonna select an amount for how much you want them to buy it for. Save and continue. You can see um, accept all currencies. All right. So here, like I said, you have to upload a trailer and then you have to upload that main video. So we're just going to. Upload a trailer and upload a main video and delete all this later. Okay, so after you've upload, successfully uploaded the trailer and main video, go ahead and click save. And it's going to want you to add music credit. Is it gonna let me go? Okay. All right, so now it's going to want you to add a poster. So you're gonna head, go ahead and uh, follow these prompts. Um, it recommends to get a 1080 pixel by 1600 pixel poster. So you can go ahead and um, look online to see what kind of D DIY design uh, software there is online and just create this uh, 1080 by 1600 and then go ahead and make a poster for your video quickly. It's simple. Like, like they said, they want, want you to keep it simple, but it won't let you publish unless you have one. So you have to go ahead and go do that. And it should just be the title and a brief description or just the title of your uh, video. Okay, so for now we're just gonna we're just gonna add a okay, save and continue. 
All right, so a lot of this you don't have to put anything in. You can go ahead and go through that if you want. Promotions, same thing. Audience. Um, you can add your social links to your video um, if you want people to easily share them. Allow comments, so you can go ahead and go through all of these and, and make sure you select which ones you want and don't want. When you're finished with everything, go ahead and click Publish Page and Videos. It's going to give you this warning here. Don't worry about it. All right, so your video is now live at the price of $30. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and so this is here it is now. Watch trailer, buy for 30. Here's your poster, here's your title. Um, all right, so we're going to go ahead and go to your videos. And you can see that it shows up here under test four, under VOD. All right, so we're going to copy the link when you're ready to publish on your site. And we're gonna to go to video library. And you're going to edit. And you're gonna go ahead and drop that link. Apply. Save. Okay, so right away it's going to show you that trailer. That's why that cover says watch trailer, but you can choose not to use that if you don't want to. So this is just showing you the trailer, and then it shows you that buy $30. Now, so you can watch all of that, and then when you click on the buy 30, I'm just going to join with Facebook for now. All right, and then it's going to have me put in my uh, billing information, and then go ahead and, and your users can buy that. Simple. <laughs> I know you'll, you'll probably have questions, so don't hesitate to reach out. Um, so here's a, only space for two videos. Uh, I didn't put this in the Squarespace tutorial, but to add a new space for another video, go ahead and click Edit, and then you're going to find that little sideways teardrop. Click a video. You're going to drop in your uh, new video on demand link here. Put a custom thumbnail in there if you wish. And then click apply. Okay, to delete any of these, you just hover over and delete. You might want to add a spacer in between here. And when you add another one here, you can add another spacer there. All right, so it's pretty simple. And then to add that title, you would just hover over click text. Make sure it's the right size. So you're just going to check to see it says heading four. So you're going to change that to heading four. And then you have that button. So to add the button, you're going to hover over, click button. You're going to left align. And you're going to click, I have a password. I'm sorry. I have a password. And then you're going to put in the uh, private password protected video link that you're going to upload on Vimeo, the duplicate that isn't a video on demand. And you're going to paste that in there. And they're going to be able to put a password in for that one. OK? All right, so I'm going to leave the video library in your main navigation, navigation so that you can test um, these out. Just remember to log out of Vimeo when you're testing because um, it won't 
it won't look the same if you're logged in. It'll let you just view it without having to pay for it. Okay, so I wanted to show you one last thing. Um, it's going to be how you get paid on Vimeo. Um, so you're going to go to your settings when you're logged into Vimeo. And you're going to go to on-demand payments. Okay, so right now I was testing it and it's set up to my PayPal, but I'm going to go ahead and change that to yours. Connect PayPal account. All right, so when people are purchasing um, your videos, it's going to go directly to your PayPal. I do want to remind you, um, there's this banner up here. If uh, you must submit a tax form for your VOD revenue. It will be subject to 24% withholding. Um, so right now, payment status, your next payments will be subject to 24% withholding because you haven't filled out the tax forms. So make sure um, once you get a chance to submit those forms and you'll get paid via uh, PayPal on your videos. Okay.